Hello, I'm Javier and welcome to Taborno. With my colleague Tania, we decided to create the company TVT. That means activity and connectivity. And uh, what we wanted to do is to try to connect people doing activities. Uh, through activities. So our idea was to try to make a different kind of tourism, more sustainable tourism, and try to promote the identity of the Canadian people. That is, uh, we are like a, we are a hotspot of uh, biodiversity and culture, and many times what we are seeing is uh, something completely different. No, so it's a, it's a place for sun and be. That's all. No, so we wanted to offer something different. Actually, we wanted to know about our, our place. Personally, I'm from here, from Tenerife, and during uh, three years I've been learning about this island, I became tour guide. It was quite, quite interesting to really realize what I have in here, in this island. And what we are doing right now is to try to develop one unique activity. So we do one thing that is a um, heritage interpretation. We design the whole activity in order to be like, like a movie. It's interesting because it's like a movie. We love to do hiking, but uh, in order to do a much better hiking, we do this kind of movie during the hiking. So we interpret it. We interpret the heritage, the culture, the nature, and we try to, you know, to, to put the tourists or the traveler, because we, we prefer to call them traveler, in the middle of this kind of um, activity, this kind of movie, and allow them to be the actor. We started to be uh, like a social uh, association. So at the beginning, we were a social association. We are not like the many companies that started like a company and then it had this kind of feel of, you know, social responsibility. But this it was more like, a, you know, we started social and then realized that if we really want to make it sustainable, it has to be sustainable economically as well. So then we decided to create the company. At the beginning, we created like a small NGO and we were like more focused on really know what we have in here and for sure to promote the identity of the people. You know, what, what do we have in here? And I think what many people are missing when coming here to the Canary Island and coming here to Tenerife, is they are missing the people. We have this resource so easy and I think we, everybody can win. It's a win-win situation in which locals can improve because they know people from outside, they can learn languages, they can have opportunities abroad, and the foreigners have, for sure improve, uh, wins as well because they, they know one place in a completely different way. What we are really trying to do, like make it more social, is what, what we're trying to protect in here is the identity. We don't want that, for example, in this place we have this go keeper that is uh, having this kind of tradition that is um, really important, but we don't want him to be different. We don't want him to act. Actually, it's uh, really, really interesting because he asked me one time, what do I have to do? I say, be yourself, because that's, that's the value. That's the value, that's the real value. And I think doing this is one economic uh, added revenue to the, to the local people. That's the, our focus, you know, our main goals. Well, my history is that I was traveling around the world. I was uh, helping in Nicaragua. I was volunteering in the, in the uh, United Nations program um, for development. I was uh, like 10,000 kilometers away from my islands, working in these, these uh, communities that, that I really love it. But then I realized in Canary Island we also have problems and we have somebody, you know, to try to solve them. For us, it was easy. So we have like a lot of unemployment rate. I think the majority of my friends are abroad. They are in Germany because they wanted to, you know, to have a better job. And I decided at least to try to change this uh, kind of uh, tourism that we have in here. This kind of mass tourism that uh, avoid the local people and it doesn't benefit the locals. I had these two options, or go abroad and to work in Germany, or to be in here and at least to try to do what I would like to do. The most important skill is uh, courage. To see one thing that you want to do and just to fight for it. The rest you will learn. The rest you can learn about uh, how to do web page, you can learn about everything. But the, the one thing that you need is, the, you know, to be focused, to have courage and to have a resilience in order when you have some of the strikes, just to stand up again. 
My dream is just to be walking every day in the mountains to try to share our nature and our culture with the, with the people who really want to know about that, to help in these environmental projects that we, said we, we do many times with our NGO and with the governments that we are working with uh, normally, and to try to do more uh, environmental leisure. That's uh, really important. How to protect the environment and having fun with that. That's really, really important. And I think this is, to me, that's, uh, that's my dream. My job is the best one. I'm getting paid for hiking in these amazing mountains. So I'm, I'm pretty sure there is no better job. This is a job that is always you are learning. That's the most important for me. This is uh, always new. It's so creative because you are making movies, you are interpreting all the, all the paths, all the hiking. This is the, I think, one of the best jobs that I've ever been. <laughs> it is.